Here is a System 80A board set for Ice Fever that I just repaired. And I want to show you how to attach the ground mods for the boards when you get the boards back. And the first thing I did was implemented the ground mods on the power supply. So underneath, between the PCB and the cold plate, there's a wire that attaches from ground, this ground trace, to this st standoff on the PCB. Now I added a one inch long 6-32 screw here and a uh, SEMS nut to attach this ringlet which has four wires crimped into it. And w one of those wires has got another ringlet and this one you screw into or underneath a screw where the ground connects on the head lock. On the MPU and the other boards, I provided a single pin Molex connector and just attach it to one of them that it fits onto. I've got plenty of wire available, so you'll be able to find out which one goes to quite easily. Now, I know some folks will say, wait a minute, you're solving a connector problem by adding a connector. Yeah, that's true, but I have instead of the edge connectors that so famously fail on Gottlieb games, this is a Molex Trifurcon pin and header, and it's the header is soldered to the ground trace on the back of each of these boards, so this should be good to go. So that's how you do it. This solves the ground modifications for the PCBs. Now, there's still the ground modification that we recommend is in the pin wiki, which is to tie the grounds that are coming from the driver board all together and check out the pin wiki, pin wiki for that mod.